Guys, a Bizer here, and it's time for another episode of our Pokemon Rising Ruby Nuzlocke Challenge. As you guys saw at the beginning of the episode, we did a nice little grinding montage. Uh, it was probably like two, three minutes for you guys. It was over an hour for me, so that was super fun. And if you guys didn't notice, um, all the amazing Pokemon that I found in the Granite Cave that we could have gotten, yay! But we got the greaterest. We got the greaterest. Um, so let me go ahead and uh, show you guys what we got here. I, I stopped at a at a certain point because I got bored. Um, so we got Swell to 24. Or my, my main goal I wanted to get was Volcarina and Mind up to level 20, which we did. Like they got to level 25, Krillin got to level 16, and the Greaterist got to level 15. I kind of, I just got, I, I really just <laughs> didn't want to grind anymore. Um, it was just taking way too long. So now at this point, we're going to go ahead and take on the second gym. With that, we're going to be relying on Swello because uh, this is the fighting gym, so we're going to hopefully have ourselves a good second gym badge and have Swello do some work. I know that they're probably every single one of these fighting mods because it is uh, Dryano Hacker is going to have some type of rock move, so uh, that'll be fun to deal with. But luckily, we do have a fully evolved Pokemon here, uh, so hopefully Swello can do some nice damage here. We're just going to Mario Lace it on through. Um, Mickey, yeah, you ain't you ain't living that. So I'm not sure what Brawly's gonna have. And is Brawly gonna be dangerous and not want to do so? Okay, okay, we're gonna have mind foos and whatnot in here, which means fake outs are coming through. I don't know if you guys saw or if you guys were even able to notice when I was doing the grinding montage that Hariyama likes to go for fake out on the third and you know second and fourth move times because that totally works. I don't know what what that was all about. I thought that there would be something a little smarter on that. And uh, hold on, I gotta quit Skype real quick. Uh -huh. There we are. Okay. Oh, that's right. That's right. It's a little light show thing on my doohickeys that we gotta go. We gotta step on the light so we can see the gym and see what ways and paths we gotta go through. Are you? Your black belt, Hideki. What do you got, Hideki? You got a Tyrogue? I got a Swellow, and I don't think your Tyro is going to be able to do much damage on you, so I'm hoping, I'm hoping that this gym is going to be, okay, we got Mock Punches, so that we're going to have to deal with priorities, and Rock type moves most likely, so at least Mock Punch is neutral, that's good, didn't do too much damage, because I mean, this is a Tyro, and it's a fully evolved Swellow, 
but you know, I'm still nervous. I'm still quite nervous. We got Makuhita. Oh, that's what I meant. Not not Hariyama. Hariyama is the evolved form. Makuhita's were using the fake out, so I'm guessing it's a fake out. No, 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 no fake out. Oh, I guess one of the wild ones like to use fake out over and over. But he's probably going for the second turn fake out. Probably that's what he was going for. That super because it's unexpected. I would never, I would never personally expect it. Being a competitive battler, expect someone go for the second turn fake out. You know what I mean? It's just kind of like faint attack. Huh. I mean, it's better than leech life, I suppose. But I don't really know what the point I'm using. A faint attack would be when I have bite, and they have the same base. I believe I should have checked. I think faint attack 60. I don't honestly remember, but. Hmm. I don't honestly remember, but you know, whatever. Okay, let's see. Where are we going? Alright, we gotta go like this. Over around this way, and right there, man. Boom, look at that. Hello. Hello there. I will crush you. Oh, will you? Will you now, Black Battle Girl Tessa? You thinking you can defeat me with your Ryolu? Nah. I hope you don't have a Lucario. That would not be fun if you had a fully evolved Lucario. That I'd have to deal with. I mean, I do have leg day. Leg day would probably easily be able to handle you because of good old ground types and whatnot, and your steel type would be resisted. Krogunk. Ooh. Now we're getting into the Pokemon. Now we're getting into the Pokemon. Okay, anticipate. Ooh, you're gonna learn that I have a move that is. I think. What does anticipation do? It, it shudders if I have a move that's super effective. I think that's what it does. I don't know. It's it's one of those abilities that you rarely ever see. Because it's kind of useless. I mean, let's see. What is, uh, yeah. Toxic Rogue has dry skin. Is it its hidden ability, I think? So that's when it, everybody runs when you play with it. There's no reason to run anticipation. It's going to let you know if you have a psychic or flying time move, I suppose. But it's not really all that usefulness. Okay. Uh. Huh. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Okay. The issue is you can't see the entire path. Okay, let me try this again. Where's your opening? Okay. Like this. Up. That way. Oh, can I not go? Can I not go through there? Can I not go through there? I can fit through that little spot right there? You can, I'm pointing to the screen. Like, you could see me point, but apparently I can't. Oops. Okay. Eh. Alright, whatever. Oh, we're at Brawly. Excellent. Okay. Let's go ahead and save us on up, because only you can prevent like, save data lossage. Um, did Swell even take damage? I think it did, just a little bit. 7 HP. Do I have a bit... <sighs> Am I going to regret that 7 HP? I think I'm going to regret that 7 HP. So I'll probably do a little cut, and we'll be right back at the gym. Because you probably don't want to watch me walk to the Pokemon Center. So I'll be right back. Alrighty, we are back. And you can never be too safe. So that's why we went and went to the Pokemon Center. And that's 7 HP. You never know. Watch, watch in this game. Swell is going to live on 7 HP. And then I'm going to be like, see, I told you. That's why we went and healed. Okay. Alright, let's take on Brawly. Alright, Brawly. With your working outness. You know what voice I'm going to do, don't you guys? Yeah, my name is Brawly. I'm the Dwarf World City GM. I've been charged in the rough ways of these parts, and I've grown tough in using this cave in the outskirts of the town and my training ground. All about using this equipment in my GM. So you want to challenge me? That will be what you are made of. Let's see. Alright, let's do this. Alright, Brawly. You got fireworks going off. I, that's, that's not fair. I wish I had fireworks going off. Machop. Okay. I think I can handle him a chop. You ain't got the moth punch. You can have bullet punch. Well, that ain't stab. Alright. Alright, my chop. You only level 18, so we good. Swellow, you can do this. I believe in you. Let's go. Should have probably checked to see if I had potions. I didn't. That's my bad. That is my bad. I was kind of expecting, like, all these mons to have, like, the berries. You're gonna have ice punch. I know you. I know you. I remember you. You killed Believe. I remember you. You little bastard. But you ain't gonna live this time. You ain't gonna get no ice punch off on me today. No siree. No siree. Alright, what you got? Come on, man. Timber. Psst. Psst. 
What's a timber to an aerial ace? All your mods are level 18. Now I kind of feel kind of bad that I, I grinded. I thought they were going to be in their 20s. That's my bad. But you know, it is a Dreano hack. And you can never be too safe on the levels. That is a fact. As you guys saw in the first gym, we kind of lost a couple of people there. Oh, uh, knockoff. Heck yeah. Um... I'm gonna get rid of Seism Toss. It doesn't seem to be that quite useful to me right now. I'm gonna get rid of Seism Toss. I know it's good base damage, blah, 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 blah. But I just, I, meh, we don't think we need it. I don't think we need it. What do we got? Pancham. All right. All right, and is this your ace? No. Oh, you're not, you're not dark yet, are you? You're kinda, this match, this battle is not as intense as I was thinking it was gonna be. Swell is kinda just running job here. Uh, so let's kind of just run and shop here. Who's your ace? Who's your ace? Scraggy? Scraggy your ace? Because everyone's been at level 18. No, Scraggy's at level 18 too. Oh! I see what you doing. I see what you doing. Going for that Intimidate. Alright, let's see if we still Oko. We do. See what you're doing. You're, you're setting me up for when your ace comes out. Okay. Okay, I see how I see what you're doing, Dreano. I see what you're doing. There he is. There's the Hariyama. Um, that is actually really unfortunate that we took that Intimidate. That really is unfortunate. I wasn't expecting that. I totally didn't process that in my mind. Um. So, do we want to go into Leg Day? Yeah, we'll go into Leg Day. Um, cause I ain't risking nothing. I ain't risking nothing. I know I'm gonna go for the fake out. I don't want to see fake out. He lives the aerial ace and he goes to rock too, and I die. Or, or rock stone edge. Rock stone edge. That that made sense. Um, yeah, I can go for a yawn. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go for the yawn. I'm gonna fake out. Yeah, which does. Yeah, that did more than I thought. 12 HP damage. It did more than I thought it was going to do. I'll go for the yawn. I outspeed, so that's good to know. Um, so that means he should fall asleep next turn. Oh, no. oh, 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 oh no. Oh no, that's not good. Oh no, that's even worse. Oh, oh yeah! Oh! Okay, um. Alright. Okay. All right, um, Mud Bomb, does that lower accuracy? I don't remember what you do, or do you lower speed? What you do? I don't remember, okay, it does something. Lowers accuracy, okay, that's what we want. That's what we want, this Hariyama is not plus two. It's not good, I should have honestly switched into, I was, ah, this isn't gonna go for a rock type move. Citrus? Mother fudger. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 <laughs> Well then, we seem to be in a little bit of a pickle here. I kind of let that happen. I kind of let that happen. Um, hmm. Yeah, let's see here. Uh, what is your defense? 66. Uh, what was... Swellow's is, like, negative. Yours is, like, negative. Leg day was 20... was 47, so... Alright, so mine can take a hit. That's good to know. That's good to know. Um... To be honest, I'm pretty sure we're sacrificing Greaterist right now. Yeah, I'm, uh... I'm 100% uh, confident that's what we're doing. <laughs> um... <laughs> Sorry, Greaterist, uh, but your time to shine is now. You should actually be able to eat that up. It's quad resist. No, 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 you're not, no. You're not eating that up at all. Okay. <laughs> um, we have a potion, so I suppose we can use that on leg day. And before he starts setting up all over on me. Oh, I probably outsped this. I could have gone for a Confuse Ray. By does Vital Throw not miss? Because I have a pl minus two accuracy on you, and you have landed every single freaking hit. 
Alright, TBH, um, I'm gonna go into mine. Because I know I should be able to take a hit from you. What does Baby Doll Eyes do? Wait, hold please. Oop, I hit the camera, or the camera, the, uh, the, um, the thingy. What do you do? User, oh, lowers its attack stat. Ooh, we might. Should we do that? We can go for a. Uh, should we go for damage? Or would you go for the attack? Alright. Let's see how much. Let's see how much. How much the magical leap does. Let's see. It's stab. It, uh, that does like negative damage. That's good to know. That's, uh, that's good to know. Ooh, definitely should have went for the baby doll eyes. Okie dokie. Um. I played this really badly. I played this really badly because I think we gotta sacrifice Krillin now. Which is not good. At all. Oh dear. Oh dear. Yeah, we gotta sacrifice Krillin. I'm sorry, Krillin. But, uh, I'm sorry. Sorry, buddy. I'm, I'm actually a little sad about this one. Krillin, I'm sorry. You, uh, you did what you had to do. You did your job. You're giving Swallow a safe switch in. I was kind of really hoping you would tank at least one of those hits so I can get a heal off on mine, but... Alright. Swallow, you gotta come on in now. And, uh, I'm gonna go for the Aerial Ace. And, uh, hopefully it kills. Oh, God. Okay, Hariyama gets Bullet Punch. Is it gonna heal though? That's the thing. Uh, is, is, is Brawly gonna use a healing item right now? That is the thing of things. I could set focus energy and... Uh, oh dear. Oh dear. I should have definitely gone for the baby doll eyes with mine. That's unfortunate. There's the heal. There's the heal. And I don't have any super potions or anything. Actually, you're gonna be. Okay. Maybe we'll be okay? Here's another super potion. I think they have a max of two. Ho 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 ho! With the grit! You get in the grit earlier and save me from having a heart attack, but it's okay. That is why you heal. Did you not see that? I lived on 3 HP because I went back to the Pokemon Center and healed. You see? That is why you do what you do when you do the things and the stuff. Okay? That was a... That definitely turned into more of a nail biter than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, okay, you've got the gym badge and I'll take it. Okay, that was, I was, I mean, I was just like, Swallows, you know, freaking going all through here. We got the knuckle badge, nothing, and then Hariyama comes up and starts setting the bulk ups, and I just shit my pants. <sighs> okay. The other knuckle bags makes it to all the Pokemon at level 30, even though you didn't trade away without question, huh? You know what? I think you can make full use of these too. It makes your Pokemon back up with muscles. Yeah, I know what it does. You almost destroyed me with it. Bulk up temporarily enhances the Pokemon's muscles, boosting this attack and defense. You could start. You could see your talent becoming giant with what causes. Look at the giant wave to surf on. 
<laughs> By the way, have you been to Grand Cave? It's located in the north of this town. It's full of fascinating things and stuff like rare stones and of my friend Steven. Alright. Good to know that your friend Steven's there. I'm glad. I think we're gonna we're, we're um we need to calm it down a little bit. We're probably we're gonna end off this episode. We'll we'll fit we'll uh we'll uh we'll do Steven next time. I think we uh we had enough fun and excitement today with that Hariyama bolting up on us. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, steer that like button down below. Unfortunately, we did lose two companions, which means I wasted a lot of time leveling up Krillin. But you know, I can dang it. Okay, we didn't deposit you anyway. All right. Um. Rip Krillin, I will miss you. Rip Craterist, uh, you were definitely a thing. We've already lost five Pokemon on our journey, but we do have four strong ones that are remaining. So luckily for us, that is a thing. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, see that like button down below for, for Rip Krillin and Rip Craterist. And I guess I will see you guys next time.